I thought that was it then. Good morning. This morning I've got a jar lid and I need to pick up Roxy's wee wee because the vet needs it for her tests. Her bloods have come back and they're really good but the next bit of treatment we need the urine to work out like proteins and stuff. We've been walking for about 15 minutes and we don't have anything and we need it soon otherwise I'm gonna have to go into the vets and then walk with uh, I thought that was it then I'll have to walk with the nurse and do exactly the same thing all over again we got it literally turns off the camera and she did it and we've got enough so we're walking to the vets now whoop, whoop. we've just finished off at the old house and we've got all of the garden plants in the car falling over um, yeah so we've dug up all of those and then we're going to take them back over to the house to fill that area by the back of the kitchen I'm probably covered in mud and I noticed that yesterday's or the day a couple of days ago's vlog I've got like mud on my forehead <laughs> when I was talking so yeah and it was pouring with rain when we were doing that wasn't it glad I didn't put any makeup on or it would have all been washed off by now. Are you feeling the same? Oh uh, yeah, so glad I didn't put any guy liner on. He wears it every day. This afternoon we have spent the whole time putting up hitches and shelves. This was a task we were supposed to do a few days ago. It's been put off. I'm going to put that mirror up and then we're done for the evening. Chris made me this but a couple of years ago I went for a nap <laughs> and I woke up and he'd done that for me. Isn't that nice? You're occasionally nice aren't you Chris? Occasionally. And then we have a mirror. And this room is done. Well we kind of need to work out what's going on above the bed but for the time being that'll be fine won't it? No, it's done. <laughs> it's done is it? Yeah. Done. There's a bit of colour in here now. It's quite white, but yeah. This is the reality of living with a cat in the house. Emptying the litter tray. It's not really nice. Um, Sox was really naughty as well the other day. He I was coming down the stairs, just here, and he was in Roxy's bed and I was like, oh, that's really cute. And then I suddenly registered, that's not cute, that is a cat. Peeing. So I literally just pit him up and threw him in the lounge. You don't like that, do you, Roxy? You don't like people peeing in your bed. So we've got a week and a half left of him being in the house, and I'll be glad when it's over. Because he does spend a lot of time outside, so this is affecting him quite a lot, and us with sleeping because. He sleeps through the day. He sleeps through the day and then gets really active at night. So what happens is whilst we're sleeping, he's running around the house, he's scratching furniture, he's just being an actual pain. The night before last, he was like howling. Um, did you wake up to it, Chris? No, just me. Just me. So yeah, week and a half cannot come around too quickly. And look. The weather's still rubbish. But look at all the flowers as well along the outside here and the hanging baskets and our seating area. So when the weather's sorted, we'll be able to sit out there. And yesterday, Chris sorted this out, which is the outside light. So that's good. So when Roxy goes outside, we can kind of see what she's up to because it's quite dark out there otherwise. You're after going outside aren't you? Kind of stands by the cat flap but he hasn't tried to push through it yet so I'm just waiting for him to do that. But yeah he likes to sit here as well and just look out. And there's been a few cats walking by recently. 
I anticipate a cat fight. Roxy keeps going into one of the bushes and coming back covered in all of this blossom. Don't you? She's definitely after the hedgehog. So this evening I am... Are you, nudge, are you nudging me? You can't nudge me. This evening I am enjoying a glass of Prosecco. And I'm also having one of these, which is a light and free yoghurt. And it's so good. I'm eating loads of them at the moment. Mm. This one's raspberry. But I really like the blueberry flavour. Not that keen on the passion fruit one. Mm. Yoghurt and Prosecco. Sophisticated, I know. It's dark outside, but look at this. Look how good that light is. You can see Roxy down there. Get one then. Right, I'm going to bed now. So I will see you guys in a few days. Bye. Bye.